is uh, pushing me into the side. Oh, the wee! But I will touch this wire there, so I shouldn't do that. That was actually a lot of fun. <laughs> Going down with all the kids here, everyone looking at me. We have a little map here. Let's have a quick look what's on the map. Uh, so it seems like it's round shaped. We are here at the gate. We have the Ferris wheel and then we have all these kind of different rides and here we have them all written down. Of course you need to read some Cyrillic. That's a cafe. Hello guys. Can I get some popcorn? It's uh, salt or it's only sweet? Sugar. Only sugar or salt? No. No, salt. No. Okay, with sugar, please. One? Yes, please. Okay, thank you. Passiva. It's good, thank you. No, it's good. Thank you. We have our sugary popcorn. That's yeah, difficult because I'm holding the camera. So, up. It's popcorn, you know. I thought like the parents driving the thing, like holding the controller, but it seems like it's the, the local guy from the stand who do it. Like this guy, he's not at all related. I think the mother is like walking behind there. So there she's going. So it's a kind of babysitting as well. You can just drop up your kid and the guy is going for a ride with your kid. Oh wow, what is this? Look at these ones going here. See if like, they can bump into each other as well. I've never seen anything like that. That uh, looks very intense. Ooh. No way. No way. Uh, I like a trail, but I'm not doing that. Wow, this looks pretty interesting. It's a little train going through the the yurts, the traditional yurts. I wonder what's inside there. It's called Dairoga Skazok. I'm not sure what it means. I think Dairoga is road. Skazok, I'm not sure. Oh. Hello. What is inside? No? I can go? Okay. Let's go. All right, guys. Let's have a look what is inside these yurts, what this little attraction is going to give us. We're going to enter the first yurt here. It has a little owl on top. Are we going to see some typical... Oh, yeah. The frogs are uh, trying to scare me. Ooh. Oh, wow, look at the people there. They're turning uh, up there. I like those kind of thrills to be honest. And here as well we have the boat. They're pretty intense the rides here. I would think they're pretty chill like the ones I'm doing here. I'm not even daring to do the intense ones. I don't trust these ones guys. These are Soviet installations. We're going in the third yurt. Oh this looks like something traditional. Little house here. Wow. It's not like they made a lot of effort for the interior of these yurts. It looks all pretty old as well. It has a bit lost all the colors and look at this little car here. And we're going to enter the last yurt. Has some flames on top of that. Oh, what's this? Some uh, dragons? Oh, and here we have the, the knights defending us. That's it. That's a little yurt ride in in Bishkek. To be honest, I wouldn't advise it, but I was too curious to see what was inside of those yurts. And for one euro, you don't lose a lot, right?